everything is looking I'm going to give it a um, clean or a little deeper clean I'm gonna clean out that drawer and everything what's in there let me show you guys really quick it's chunky so I'm gonna clean out in here um, I already have clothes in the washing machine so once those finish I will add those in there I do want to do some reorganizing under the cabinet so we'll see how that goes it might be in this video it might be in the next but I definitely probably will straighten up under here with what I already have and you see, guys, see all this stuff here. So I just want to basically get everything cleaned up and tidy. That it is nasty. The tub, and this is how this area looks. Let's turn on the light. It's gonna get loud because of the fan light, but you guys can see how everything here looks. All this stuff has to go in the wash, and I definitely have to get. This is quite disgusting. My bathroom is really dirty, you guys. So it definitely needs a little cleaner. I'm definitely gonna get up in here and get all those areas right there. Toilet area, all of that. So that's that. First, before I empty out the bathroom, I just wanna show you guys this new um, cleaning product that I picked up from Target. I did a pickup and I did this online and I saw this and I wanted to try it out. Um, basically, it is a something like the, um, I forgot the name of the, the jars, where basically you refill with a little pod with water concentrate and it's good for everything so stone granite mirrors everything so being that this is a multi-purpose cleaner i'm going to use this to clean the bathroom right now along with my um soft scrub or whatever else and then i also picked up the everspring so i may switch between the two but i'm definitely going to try this out right now and then for my sinks you actually have to go under here and um screw out a little thing under there i don't have time to do that right now so what i'm gonna do is after i clean out the sink i'm going to just put some vinegar with some baking soda let it sit for a little while run down there and then i will throw some hot water in there to clean that out for the most part it should be okay because jay's kind of good on keeping up on that so i'm going to get all this stuff out of the bathroom and i'm going to spray some bleach and stuff in there let it sit the window is open i'm going to crack the door put the fan on while i get all of this done Wake you up inside 
So you guys see as I'm deep cleaning, I definitely wanted to target those areas that I don't always get on a daily basis, like the doors, you know, the walls. My house gets really dusty, which I'm sure a lot of people may go through that as well. But yeah, my house gets really dusty. So I just wanted to get everything wiped down and just touch those spaces that I don't always get to on a weekly or daily basis. And then the cleaner that I use, it actually did a good job actually cleaning the mirrors and stuff. I was surprised. It gave it a shine and stuff. The only thing is, it is a, I believe it was a lavender lemon type smell. The scent isn't the best to me. Um, the Mrs. Myers to me sounds, smells a little better. So if you're looking for something that's going to have that fragrant type smell, last thing when you use it, this is not it, but it did do an okay job cleaning. I'm going to use it some more and I can give you guys, um, a better, you know, my better opinion on it once I get to use it a little bit more. Here, this was nothing special, just a little bit of baking soda, some distilled vinegar or some white vinegar, let it sit in there for a little bit, and then I poured the hot water in there, and Jay was actually really surprised and shocked how well it worked and was telling me that I need to use it in the middle bathroom. So definitely if you guys have some slow-running faucets or you just want to clean out your drain, definitely try this out.
if you're new, my shower frame is definitely an area that I dread cleaning. Let me know in the comments below an area of your bathroom or just an area in your home that you don't like to clean. This. We hurt each other's feelings on and on I don't wanna change who you are The things you say is always one step too far But I know that I've played my part I'm hurting you as well I guess that we should say we're sorry Say we're sorry Say we're sorry I guess that we should say we're sorry Peace. 
pieces and start again Don't give up, we're holding on For what it's worth Hey y'all, this is another day um, It's a little bit later than I wanted to I think it's about noon I actually wanted to start I've been up since like real early I wanted to start early in the day But you know, there was a lot going on this morning And I wasn't sure if I was going to even be able to get start getting anything done today Basically really quick Yesterday, I actually wanted to start, you know, doing some decluttering and stuff last night. So I won't have to do it all in one day. I've been breaking everything up to keep things more simple. But long story short, I was sitting there playing video games with Sanaya and Mason. And Jay and Zoe left to go pick up some pizza for dinner. And then a little bit later, I thought he's calling me, telling me that he, you know, was in the driveway or whatever. And he's like frantic, like, we just got into an accident. I'm like, oh my God. And I uh, rushed out with Mason I um, left Sanaya with my in-laws and I went there and I'll put a picture up of how everything looked but thank God you know God is good they made it out you know they have some bum bumps and scratches and some pains in different areas from the seat belts and just um, how the accident took place you know it is the next day so they're definitely feeling it now but um yeah thank God they made it out we were, the accident happened about 6, and we were at the hospital until basically after 11. They had to go get checked out, so they were in the ambulance and everything. So, it's a lot going on with that this morning, trying to take care of some stuff like that. Uh, seeing when we can get back to the vehicle, because he was driving my mom-in-law's uh, SUV, little truck, and, uh, you know, so that's all of that. So, that's done. Um, I doubt they're going to be able to fix that. So, that's totaled. But we'll see. Um, so definitely been dealing with that. Uh, so definitely send prayers our way. Thank God, you know, that they were able to walk away from that. Because looking at the pictures, it definitely could have been a little bit uh, different outcome. Outcome. So with that, we are here. We're going to get into some motivation, you guys. That's what you're here for. But I definitely like to keep you guys up on what's going on with me. You see my room is a total mess i'm going to be tackling this my plan is to basically do some decluttering some deep cleaning i have some carpets to clean mason's room is already clean i wanted to clean his carpet i'm not sure exactly what i'm going to be getting to because i just picked up my camera and said let me start filming and trying to get some stuff done so again if you guys are getting stuff done with me today let me know in the comments below what you're up to what you're getting into but i had to run out to walmart because i had to get some more carpet cleaner I actually got my Swiffers, sorry the light, I got my Swiffers for the fan because it's a tire fan, I'm not going to be doing any climbing, and just to do some dusting of those things, we're going to be tackling this bed, I want to clean my mattress, clean the carpet in here, I need to clean off the desk area over here, just start decluttering some stuff, throwing some stuff out, seeing what I have to see what type of organizers that I may need to get. Um, if you don't know, we've been in this house for about five years now, so everything with us as far as organizers and those type of things what you see me using and stuff that i need i don't just go out just to buy but i buy stuff that i do need um for my home now oops i may um try to find things around the house that i can use and if there's nothing that i can use here then i'm definitely going to go out and purchase some things i have some ideas but again i don't want to buy things that i don't need so i'm going to declutter and once I declutter, I can see what we need and we can go from there. So definitely this is going to be another video after this. But we're going to just get everything started and see how much we can get done. Um, I don't have that much sun. It's kind of a dreary day. So I'm going to clean probably two carpets today. And I'll try to do two more carpets tomorrow and get as much done as I can. But again, let's go ahead and get into it. Really quick, giving you guys an overview of my room. Definitely going to be cleaning all this off. Um, this stuff is going to end up going in front soon because I will be doing my little spring decor, changing some things up. All these things here, you guys, is just a lot of junk and junky. So I got a lot to tackle in here. So I hope you guys are along for the ride. <laughs> Said, yeah, it kind of broke my heart 
loving you is not so goddamn easy as you think I'm trying my best to hold on but I feel myself giving You know that we shouldn't keep it up like this We hurt each other's feelings on and on I don't wanna change who you are The things you say is always one step too far But I know that I've played my part I'm hurting you as well Again, don't give up, we're holding on For what it's worth, I'll try to change We can't fix our broken hearts Loving me is not so goddamn easy as I think You try your best to hold up, but I see you're giving in You know that we shouldn't keep it up like this We hurt each other's feelings on and on I don't wanna change who you are you say is always one step too far But I know that I've played my part I'm hurting you as well I guess that we should say we're sorry Like this, we hurt each other's feelings on and on. I don't want to change. Vacuum all of that out. This is clean. It's clean. Now I'm going to get to my desk area. finished i went through everything jay's gonna have to go through his stuff i don't want to touch his stuff but everything that was out i basically um you know cleans it up cleared off the top of the desk got underneath dusted everything off this bin here actually has like school supplies i'm gonna get one of those pushing carts a roller cart i'm thinking to do that and i'll show you guys how i organize that when i get it but i just wanted to see what i had in here and what i had to throw out and then those are just papers as well that probably will go on that cart. And then over here is situated. I basically have papers and stuff that I go to every day to look at things that I take care of. So that's that stuff right there. But I will find a better way to organize that once I get my desk area um, situated. In the future, I will be doing a little, you know, um, bedroom, office, 
type of makeover being that it's a shared bedroom right now with the, with our office space i definitely want to do something that's gonna you know make me want to get up and come sit at my desk all day so that's that that's the garbage that's there these pillows need to go up front this is stuff to go in the bathroom that i have to put out there um you see the dress and everything is cleaned off i'm watching sisters i'm not sure that's something you guys watch on BET, but i have that playing in the background um now i'm going to go onto the bed i'm first going to wipe up off there with the swiffer then i'm going to just roll this out with my little lint roller i'm going to strip this bed i'm going to throw some cleaner on there i'll let you guys know what i'm going to use and then i'm going to also clean off this fan before i strip the bed being that i have to wash these sheets and change them out underneath my bed is good yeah underneath my bed is good because i had to move my mattress and stuff not too long ago so under there is fine i also need to clean my window jams right here so i'll see if i can get to that today or if i have to do it in another video but i definitely want to get that done um i may just include that in another deep clean we'll see because time is winding down and i want to start working on this carpet while i still have some sun and also working on my mattress so it can dry before you know the nighttime comes after my sheets and stuff wash I'm on my way now I'm on my way now so i finished cleaning up everything i've actually back in my room i had to take a break because i'm dealing with the kids as well while doing this um but i'm not going to clean my windows today the um jams of the windows today because i want to get up front and spend time with them but i definitely wanted to get the mattress done and this carpet done so it can dry um, before the end of the night so i already mixed up my cleaning product that i'm going to be using on my mattress which i'm using this bottle right here i just added eight ounces of hydrogen peroxide three tablespoons of baking soda, and a couple drops of Dawn dish detergent. And we're going to use that along with my um, vacuum cleaner to clean the mattress. Now, you can just use this product with just a rag, but I just want to just be in that I do have a vacuum cleaner, um, carpet cleaner, sorry. Then I'm going to just use that to clean everything off, try to get the stains out. And I'm going to show you guys how everything looks before, and I'll definitely show you guys how it looks after, and you tell me what you think. So this is my mattress. Um, we will be changing this out sometime in the future, but for now, I'm just going to clean it. This, these stains here could be from anything. I'm not even sure what they're from, but we don't, you know, wet the bed. But I guess it's just natural stains that came through. So I'm going to target these areas that you see here, these little areas here. I'm not going to soak the whole mattress, but it's just areas that I'm going to target. And then once I finish doing that, I will throw some... Um, baking soda on there as well and just you know let it sanitize it as well to deodorize it and then i will vacuum that off as well and if you're new you guys don't know i have a hoover vacuum cleaner i purchased this from walmart um they still have it available i can link it below if you like or it's also linked over in my like to know it but uh yeah this is from walmart basically i filled this side with some warm water and being that i'm using my um little cleaning product I didn't fill up the other side so once I start to vacuum the, the carpets and I'm going to fill it up with the carpet cleaner solution life goes up and it goes down I know my mom taught me that I figured why we fool around 
counts a little And we keep track of time Being so serious, idiots Thinking it will matter Keep me company downtown Before the clock runs out Sun is shining but the rain is welcome too Friends are nearby, don't need another view Time is not on my mind but then it's you Oh, I love it when the love comes around and then all things must pass But I'm not gonna wake up, wake up I'm not ready, let me have another day Don't wake up, wake up Keep it steady, cause I'm happy I'm not gonna wake up No, no, not yet, whoa No, not yet, whoa No, no, not yet, whoa I'm afraid I'll end up nowhere they keep saying I'll be fine, but how you know that I'll be there? When it feels like it is drying, you guys. You can see it definitely looks a lot more better. The little yellow marks that you could see before, you do not see them. You can tell why I did spray the um, product at the cleaner. You can't see the difference there. So that's why that area looks like that. But I did, you know, get all the marks out except for this one right here. I would probably have to let it soak a little bit more to get that out and that right there. Probably blood from when Jay shaves or something like that. But um, yeah, for the most part, it is clean. I forgot to get right here, so I'm gonna touch that real quick. I didn't even notice that. I'm gonna clean that up. But for the most part, um, the mattress is clean. It's better than what it was. And again, I will throw a little baking soda on there another time and let it uh, freshen it up some more and vacuum that off. But right now I'm gonna just get into vacuuming my carpet and this is what we got out of the mattress let me show you guys really quick this is what we got out of the mattress from vacuuming everything up this is just for my mattress so yeah that's nasty you never know what's in something until you start really getting deep down in it but that's nasty Lying every time someone asks how it goes And I save the details that actually mean something mm -hmm. Sun is shining but the rain is welcome too Friends are nearby, don't need another view Time is not on my mind but then it's you Oh, I love it when the love comes around And then I remember All things must pass but I'm not gonna wake up, wake up I'm not ready, let me have another day Don't wake up, wake up Keep it steady, cause I'm happy I'm not gonna wake up No, no, not yet, whoa No, not yet, whoa No, no, not yet, whoa So I just had to refill this again And basically I did all of that there through here if I show you guys everything it's gonna take forever but you get the gist of it and now I'm going to work this area here and for the floor this is how the water is looking so yeah that's really nasty out here about to clean about to clean this carpet and I just wanted to show you guys the before uh, mostly worn over here because that's where the dog likes to lay in this area here as far as the walking but I'm gonna clean everything off and I'm gonna also show you guys the girls room this is the girls room and I also vacuumed their carpets already you can see little darker parts this is basically you know wear and walking and stuff like that feudal things on the carpet there the room is actually already cleaned. Um, I'm just doing the carpet in here today. But I definitely wanted to show you guys it before. Excuse the lighting. Um, it's kind of a dreary kind of day. 
comes and goes but that's it for in here so i'm gonna go get started on the front say i'm sorry boo and i know you never mean it gets you in The edges are probably going to buckle up, but I shared over my Pinterest how I get the creases out of my rug. Um, if you guys want to check that out, it's over my Pinterest page. The link should be in the bio below, or the description box below for you guys. That is it for here, and now I'm going to head into the girls' room. I'm not angry, I got better things to do. Tell your friends I will be just fine. Don't need no therapist, there's nothing like Nothing like wine just want to show you guys this is from the girls room every room you guys can see was you know disgusting of course it's expected normal you know everyday walking and stuff like that but this is how the carpet is looking I don't want to walk on it, but I'm showing you guys can remember how dark it was before over there. But now I'm going to just let it dry. I didn't want to wet it up too much because, like I said, it's not really sunny day today. And I don't want it to take too long to dry so they can get in bed later. But that is definitely a lot better than what it was looking like. And probably another week or so, probably in two weeks, I'll come through and I'll do it again in their room and also in my room. This is Mason's room, which is not too bad. I need to do it too. But... You guys can see he is fast asleep. Yeah, so I'm not going to do anything in his room today. So that's basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed um, all this cleaning motivation. I am going to show you guys how my closet looks just to preview to my next video and what that's going to look like, um, what I'll be decluttering in there. Again, no judgments. Keep the comments. Raise the comments so yourself if you can leave any. I really don't want to hear them, um, but it's just a lot to deal with. So I'm going to show you guys what my closet looking like. I'll probably end up doing some decluttering in my drawers and share that with you guys as well. And I just need to go pack up the stuff, put the stuff up in the bathroom. So I'll show you guys that, and then that's going to be it for this video. And I'll see you guys next time. And I'm definitely going to be bringing you guys a spring clean, little decorate, just a little few pieces here and there. Um, in the family room and then also in the kitchen and if I decide to put anything anywhere else I'll definitely let you guys know So again, no judgment. I will definitely show this again in another video, but this is how my closet is <laughs> Looking this shelf is like it wants to fall down um, Yeah, so this is my closet I Have like I said an idea of how I'm going to set up a system in here for me to get everything together this right here is actually my mother-in-law's clothes so i don't have room to hang those things up that don't need to be on the shelf so we're going to be taking care of all of that but i just wanted to show you guys a preview of what is coming up for my closet declutter and organize so but i'll also be sharing it in the other video so you'll definitely see it again if you missed it here mm -hmm.